What up, y'all? Welcome back to Crystal Skull Bling, baby. What's up, y'all? Welcome back to our tutorial YouTube channel. Thank you guys so much for liking, commenting, and subscribing. I've been seeing a lot of new subscribers lately. We're almost at 500. What? Crazy. You guys are amazing for sharing us out and giving us all the love. So today we've got a bonus video and this has been highly requested, sunglasses or just glasses in general, but mainly sunglasses. Um, so we're gonna dive right the heck in. Oh my gosh, these are serving, honey. I cannot wait for you guys to see the end. They are summers. So first you need an adhesive and today we are choosing Liquid Fusion. This is a heavy duty resistant um, glue. It is amazing. I love this stuff. Um, it's kind of a new go-to glue for me. I don't know, I just, uh, like lately, I've been killing it with Liquid Fusion. Um, I'm gonna be using a Glue It Right bottle from our website and a 18 gauge needle um, attachment. And then we have our Crystal Clear Stones in sizes SS30 all the way down to an SS4, I believe. Um, and then of course, my tool of choice, my loves, is the Be Sweet to Each Other Colors of Kindness Crayola Crown. Yes, and we did introduce some new crayons on my website because, come on now, we have to have them on the site, right? So go grab you some. There will be links in the description of everything that I will be using, so make sure that you go and check that part out. We're also going in with Millennium Star by Mr. Fancy Pants. Nicole Worley, this glitter is perfection. Okay, <laughs> it is, <laughs> it is perfection. Um, this is going right into our liquid fusion. I get that question all the time. Can you mix glitter into your adhesive? Yes, you can. Um, I do recommend that it be a fine cut glitter. Um, I have done chunky before, but on like a, like a flat, flat surface. Um, so you can do it, just mix it into your glue. Um, so you could have, you could have done this in the bottle, out of the bottle, however you want to mix your glitter into it, but it can be done and it cures just fine. It doesn't affect the glue at all. Um, so now we are going in with the nail file, of course. We gotta sand our products, you guys, uh, our projects, you guys, because sanding them down, um, it is it is a scoring process. Um, you find this a lot in clay making, and so uh, slick to slick, it just it just don't stick, baby. Okay, um, so having something for that glue to um, sit onto. Um, to hold on to that traction between the glue and your surface that is very 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 important when you are blinging so um, i don't care what other people say you got to sand your projects okay <laughs> so make sure you do that that we don't want any stones falling off okay we don't need that we've got to prep our surfaces properly a little bit of 91 percent alcohol to rub off all that dust and debris make sure that it is pristine and clean before going in with your glue if there's anything underneath those stones you guys are going to be popping off and we do not want them to pop off, okay? We don't need that. Um, no drama for your mama, okay? No popping off over here. So here we are doing a scatter mix uh, pattern. We're just going in like a little puzzle um, because I am the scatter queen. I love scatter pattern, you guys. I cannot, I cannot, I cannot stress this part enough. My brain absolutely loves this pattern. It is my favorite. I will be doing mainly scatter pattern on this page. Um, I will introduce you guys to some other stuff as well if requested. So I went really heavy on uh, on the on the cluster here. We did a little cluster on this end, um, and then I was gonna go in and do some um, kind of random littles, just kind of like star bursting off of the cluster. Um, but I wanted the cluster to dry um, a little bit first before <laughs> I went and did that. Um, so I started on the other side and went in with my big cluster on that side next. Okay, so with my squeeze bottle, um, I am just placing little dots. And these dots need to be, um, if you can get it this small, this just really takes some control on your part. <laughs> um, uh, just a little bit of glue is gonna go a long way for this. So your glue needs to be about um, half the size of the stone that you're putting down. Um, it will form like a small little glue pocket around the edge of the stone. Um, so keep that in mind. 
to me, it keeps like they just stick better. Um, and so doing that, you'll be able to do little tiny scatters of these teensy tiny stones um, and get this beautiful starburst effect. And for me, there's no like rhyme or reason. Um, the size to me didn't really matter uh, because of the cluster that we did at the top. I could have done bigger stones as well, but I decided to do kind of the elegant little small accents um, and add those around the rim. And then I stopped, I did stop. Um, I didn't go all the way around the sunglasses. I just kind of like stopped on these little midpoints um, so that there was more of the, the original sunglasses in the middle and towards the top and bottom on the opposite ends of each lens. Okay guys, and then we just continued this onto the earpiece of the sunglasses. Um, I don't know if that's like the technical term for these, um, but that's what we're gonna call them today. Okay, we're gonna, the earpiece. Okay, that's the part that goes onto the ear. Uh, <laughs> we're just gonna continue this pattern on here as well and we're gonna burst down the side. So I'm going to shut up my mouth um, and you guys can watch me work. Okay. But first, uh, where is Misha with my snacks? Oh, there she is. What up, Misha? Hey, girl. Y'all go follow her on TikTok, okay? That's the queen of tumblers. Love you, bye. And there she is, the luxurious, ooh, the crystallized, the bling and a bling and a bling and a bling sunglasses, honey, for your summertime wear. These are perfect for any occasion, darling. Ooh, they smexy. They're giving me all kinds of Uncle Clifford vibes. Okay, I am loving these and the way they turned out. I've been wearing them every single day. You can get these customized on my website, so make sure that you go follow me at crystalscobling.co and all over social media. We are on Instagram, TikTok, and thank you guys so much for watching my channel. I really do appreciate every single one of your follows, your likes, your comments, your shares, and all the things. So have a great day and we'll see you guys next time. Bye!